The FBI is investigating after a Tucson Border Patrol agent shot at a suspected drug smuggler. It happened yesterday in a remote area near Cowlick, Arizona. That's on the Tahana Atham Reservation. A group of agents tracking the smugglers when one of them began throwing rocks at an agent. As Not In Your Sides' Christina Myers explains, that is when the agent opened fire. As the group of Border Patrol agents approached the suspected smugglers, one of them took off. An agent followed closely behind. He stopped, the suspect stopped, picked up some rocks, and began throwing them at the agent while making verbal threats. The agent fired his gun two times but missed the suspect. Eventually, he was caught and arrested along with two others. Agents found more than 240 pounds of marijuana on them. The suspect who threw rocks is a Honduran national who had already been deported once. He's facing pending charges of re-entry after deportation and narcotic smuggling. He could face assault charges as well, depending on the outcome of the FBI's investigation. The agent Agent, a 12-year veteran with Customs and Border Protection, is on administrative leave while the investigation continues. There's uh, various levels of force that agents are allowed to employ depending upon the circumstances and then of course their uh, perception of what, what the threat is at the time. Agents go through extensive training at the Border Patrol Academy. Uh, there is extensive training uh, that takes course throughout their career, uh, quarterly basis. Meantime, another Border Patrol agent is awaiting trial for a similar incident. Lonnie Schwartz's trial date has been pushed back to November. He's accused of shooting through the border wall and killing 16-year-old Jose Antonio Elena Rodriguez, who Schwartz says was throwing rocks at him. Christina Myers, Kega 9, on your side.